It's time we dealt with Bugshot. We can't risk him taking down the Baron before you in the finals. Not to mention he deserves a little payback for what he did to our aircraft hangar. True, true. Since Bugshot's assault, the Baron has been keeping an eye on him. We can't fight him out in the open for risk of getting disqualified. Thankfully, Inspector Fox is out in the field looking for us. I hear you. We'll set them against each other. Mugshot is an international criminal, after all. Carmelita won't be able to resist. My only concern is for Inspector Fox's safety. Oh, don't worry about her. She's more than a match for a meathead like Mugshot. Okay, I'll pick a fight with Mugshot and bait him into meeting in the town square for our rumble. You do that. I'll get Carmelita's attention and lead her back here to the same place. Agreed. I've got to hand it to you, Bentley. This is a really underhanded plan. Why, thank you. I'm feeling pretty good about it. Beat it, twerp. The Black Baron's been giving me the grill since that event in your hangar. Perhaps you'd like to take out some frustration by engaging in a physical battle with me outside in the town square. No way! I'm being watched here. That, and it wouldn't feel right pounding a four-eyed runt in a wheelchair. I'm sure you wouldn't win in the fight anyway. You've got such a long, sad history of losing to the Cooper Gang. I could whip your whole gang with one arm if you jerks would sit still. Look at these arms. I'm unstoppable. You know, I've been thinking about your appearance. Look. If you don't got nothing to say nice, and don't say nothing at all. Get it? What? Ain't got no sassy comments, smart guy? Oh, I get it. You got nothing nice to say, so you're keeping quiet. That's real cute. You really got nothing nice to say? That's cold. My head is spinning from your breath. What, do you gargle with raw sewage every night before bed? Yeah, you're half right. I find a nice tang to my breath helps maintain my poisonal space. Your mother was a broken down tub of junk with more gentlemen callers than the operator. Nobody talks that way about my mother! Nobody! Okay, little broken down runt. Looks like you're gonna get broken down even more. Town Square, five minutes. Please don't be late. Okay, Sly. Bugshot is on his way outside. Go find Inspector Fox and lead her back to the town square.
Hey, Inspector Fox. Still looking for a date to the prom? Quit running and I'll pin the corsage on you. It's lie. Why run? Why not face me like a real man? Mess with me? That little punk is gonna eat dirt. <laughs> hey! You're that cop hag that busted me back in Mesa City! Mugshot, alias Two Gun Tony, also known as Meathead Mugshot. Seven foot three inches, 324 pounds, wanted in seven countries with 13 outstanding warrants for your arrest. And yes, I'm that cob hag that put you away back in Mesa. Well, wise guy, lady, feel like going for another shot at the title? It's my duty to put you behind bars. That, and I enjoy making tough guys cry like the stupid babies they really are. I ain't no stupid baby! Was yours. Ugh, booking this idiot will take all night. Oh well, I'm sure Cooper won't make his move anytime soon. feral specimen of Lupus Gigantormus. So, let me get this straight again. You plan on stalking that thing, drugging it, putting the guru on board, and setting the two free to smash up the guards? An airtight plan, I agree. In simplicity itself, by channeling the wild destruction housed in that bloodthirsty creature, we should be able to thin out the Black Baron's ranks. Which, of course, means fewer enemy pilots flying against you in the files. I'm all for evening the odds in our favor, but come on, this plan seems a little... risky. Not at all. I've modified my sleep darts with heavy doses of skunk bulb. It should be enough to pacify the beast, provided he doesn't catch wind of me first. Alright, that sounds okay. You can hang back and shoot him at a distance. Uh... Well, given the weight of the darts, I'll need to sneak up behind him and take a shot within a few meters. Meters? Quit trying to freak me out and put the guru on the binocucom. After I put the wolf to sleep, it'll be up to you. Fawada, hoja. Thanks, guru. You always know just what to say. Yeah. <laughs> 
You'll have to get closer for a good shot. You were too far away to make the shot. Too far away. You'll need to get close to make the shot count. No impact. Get within a few me- Your dart was out of range. No good. You need to be close in. Behind the wolf. No impact. Get within a few meters behind the wolf. Your dart was out of range. Too far away. You'll need to get close to make the shot count. Got it. You were too far away to make the shot. No good. You need to be close in, behind the wolf to make the shot count. You'll have to get closer for a good shot. Nice one, Bentley. Cut your scent. Get out of there. Work, big game hunter. The skunk bomb is kicking in. He's almost asleep. Guru, you're up. You should be able to possess the giant wolf now that he's out. Mow down these thugs!
That's ten fewer pilots in the finals tomorrow. Done deal. should even the odds tomorrow in the finals. plan to hack into the aircraft control tower. It's simple, really. The whole system is linked through computer nodes which monitor the power generated by the nearby windmills. Seriously? All the power around here comes from the local windmills? I thought they were just for looks. The control nodes tell a different story. How do you plan to get up there? It's pretty high. My turbo chair has been outfitted with an extra afterburner. Heights such as that are nothing to me.
Prepare yourself, computer. I will show no mercy. Good thing I've got hacker code linked to the right analog stick. This data stream looks protected. Hmm, looks like I might need to transport the circular lockdown code. Finally, some challenge. Another falls before my digital kung fu. Hi -ya. Grasshopper, kneel before the feet of the master. Looks like they're going to put up a little fight this time. Digital black hole, gonna have to hack around it. Another terminal terminated. I'll make this quick and painless.
Excellent! Now for the aircraft control tower! Once it's hacked, the system will be mine! auxiliary afterburner to get over to that computer. Jump as far as you can towards it, then goose the afterburner. Go easy on the throttle, and you should get a few bursts. Go easy on your afterburner. Tap a quick thrust, then wait a couple seconds, then thrust again. You can go a long way if you conserve fuel. Wait a while between thrusts, and you can go a long way. Aha! My final opponent! Looks like they saved the big code for last. How about me? Wait, the, the code's unstable! Everything's speeding up! Windmill throwing stars, eh? This little system bug might come in handy.
Champs dogfight is beginning! With these guys going at it, no one will notice as you slip onto the gunships and plant a tracking device. Sounds straightforward enough. Where'd you get these trackers? They look kind of funny. Best I could do on short notice. They're sensitive to extreme changes in altitude. You'll have to pull this job off at high elevation or it's a bust. Shouldn't be a problem. Work, 
my boy. The gunship's GPS data is flowing in. Head back to the hangar and suit up. All right, Murray. The Black Baron's communication antenna is held up by three support beams. Pull them out of place, and the whole array will fall apart. Don't worry. If there's one thing I'm good at, it's rowing. And breaking stuff. pal look for the black baron take him out and this competition is all over and go easy on the throttle it's been sticking lately quit worrying i'll see you in the winner circle
good. Gunships, converge on my position and destroy the Cooper aircraft. Send in a spare plane as well. Roger, Baron. All units en route. Sorry, Baron, but you'll have to fight there this year. What? Who is this? How did you find this frequency? What? No? Huh? This is... Oh, I command it! Oh, this plane's come unfixed. High time for an upgrade, I say. Oh, no, you don't, you weasel. Weasels, am I? I beat you. Your biplane is in pieces. But <laughs> we're both still airborne, aren't we? The victor has yet to be decided. Then, let's settle it. Beware, my boy. I've trained ten years at Fisticus. Pugilism is my passion. If you fight as well as you fly, this shouldn't take long. On go! Hey, <laughs> hey, 
fatal blow! <coughs> That's enough! You win, Cooper! Wait, you? You're Penelope, the Baron's mechanic. No. No, you are the Black Baron! Suppose someone was bound to find out sooner or later. I guess I'm kind of relieved. But... why? Look, let's talk on the ground where it's safe. 